Hi guys, um, it's Sunday afternoon and I guess um, I've been meaning to do this for quite some time that is to show you what's in my shower I know this is kind of invasive and stuff like that and uh, it's kind of like a lit bed Sunday so I'm not dressed to the nice or anything so I just want to show you what uh, it looks like in my shower and this is a standard Singaporean shower whereby you know the floor space is really little and there's really uh, not much going on there isn't uh, even a bathtub because that's uh, Bathtubs are usually for like master bedrooms and stuff like that. So this is my and suite toilet in my room and um, this is just the entrance way. So here I've got a candle, Yankee candle burning down there and um, this is the toilet area. This um, greyish, charcoal greyish rug I have was uh, from Target when I was living in Australia and of course there you see like there's some you know, uh, washing stuff right there. That's a toilet uh, holder which you can get in IKEA. And uh, these are my um, helper stuff because I share a toilet with her. And that's where we put our dirty laundry. That's the trash can and that's the rug. And this, uh, moving on to the shower area, I always have a um, bright orange uh, shower curtain which is uh, from IKEA. As you can see that there's, there isn't any tempered glass, anything going on around here because yeah, I guess the floor space is really little and the only way that you can stop the water from going onto the towels is just by the shower curtain. So that's my shower over there. We'll skip this part because that's not mine. And whatever mine is here, which is in a shower caddy that is hung near the window and it is matching with my shower curtain. So whatever that's here is mine. So um, these are just my shower uh, you know, stuff for what I'm using now. This uh, razor is the Gillette Venus one, I believe. And I'm using Clinicare treatment, Clinicare shampoo, Clinicare conditioner, and I'm still trying to pen this uh, Joico um, conditioner. As you can see, uh, that's a little bit left. And this is my current uh, shower gel for now, which is from Crabtree uh, and Evelyn Lavender, and it's almost um, three quarters gone. I'm still trying to finish this Laniche. Um, What's that? Pore Clear Cleansing Foam. I really like this one. I've been using it for ages because the, you know, the container is so big. I'm just left with like the last one quarter before I can finish it up and pan it and so I can you know, start using a new one. So I'm also using this stress, uh, stress Relief Body Wash by Avino which I have loved in Australia and I, you know, I've gotten a few to ship back with me. And the last but not the least, this is my... This is my treatment care for now. This is by Subaki. This is damage care for your hair. And I'm just using this thing like sporadically uh, interlaced between my clinic hair. So it's kind of long. So moving on, this is uh, my shower, uh, my basin area, which, let me wash my hands, sorry. Okay, um, this is my basin area, which I brush my teeth in every day. And I use this also the plug uh, whitening one by Colgate. But I don't really like to use uh, commercial mouth washes. That's because like it's too strong in alcohol and it burns my mouth area kind of a little bit. So I don't really like it. I prefer getting it from the uh, dentist because they have a um, you know uh, less alcohol formula which I like. Okay, this is what I used to wash my hands. This is the Kiri Kiri. This is moisturizing peach. Uh, this is kind of good. I use this when I don't have my regular Dettol ones. And this area here is also all mine. Of course, you can see Cotton Puff. This is my Clarisonic Mia which I absolutely love. This is really good. And a few knickknacks here and there. There's like uh, bra hooks and stuff. Oh, sorry. Um, you know, some some like hair stuff like hair clips and stuff so this is a sample toner which I've got from the company um, for me to try so far I like it and this is another sample one uh, it comes in a gift set by Lancome so I'm trying to pen this one uh, this is my current moisturizer by the niche emulsion uh, as you can see it's a really huge bottle so I guess it will last me for like I don't know three four months or kind of stuff like that 
and I'm also trying to finish up more samples of the body shop okay and this is my Akona uh, tried pads um, I used the Akona one when I was in Australia uh, the cranberry uh, toner which can remove makeup as well and that's really lovely so this one is the same one except for that it's in pads okay below that is the Akona bar which I'm going to use after I finish panning my Laneige pore uh, cleansing foam <coughs> excuse me there this is my out of shower uh, cleanser by St. Ives this green tea cleanser it smells really lovely and it's really really good so I like it that's like a lot of products so I can use it uh, quite for quite some time this is something that's given to me uh, from my sister this is like a makeup removal spray which uh, we both don't like so we're trying to use it to clean our brushes with and this is of course contact lens solution which I'm also trying to finish using because I have um, switched from the uh, permanent monthly uh, permanent to monthlies and now I think monthlies are not good enough so I'm using dailies so I still have quite some monthly ones so I'm trying to finish using the solution with it because you know when you use dailies you don't really need to use solution all that much and then this one is what I use to clean my brushes with and this one uh, I used to really like because uh, I can get rid of my makeup <laughs> in just one wipe and you don't have to you know, wash your face again. I forgot where it's from but you can get it in Watson's. This is the Cl Cleansing Express Sebum one. And then uh, of course this one here everybody knows this is you know to clean brushes with so yeah. Okay so that's that section over there. I always tend to keep a uh, like, uh, cloth over here now. I don't used to do that previously but ever since I live in Australia, I had this luxury of having a hook there so that I can keep a clean washcloth with me at all times so that's there. And this is recently just taken out from my stash for me to use because this is like a loofah material so you can, it's like a really long cloth so that you can like do your back as well uh, as compared to a huge loofah brush. Uh, or sponge so here there are some like more hair stuff to get your face you know get the hair out of your face of course hair bands I always break my hair bands so I have backups always so this is what I use for my underarms um, I'm trying to finish using and this is the Joyco heat protectant thing I don't really like it so that's like a lot left this is my like um, what's it called um, sun tanning oil which I hardly go out to the sun nowadays so it's like it's like being there for so long I'm not sure whether I should even throw it away uh, then these are more like contact lens stuff that's all here so this one is almost used to the end of its life uh, Dali I like Dali as compared to Colgate I don't know why but you know I just like Dali so my hairbrush here so this thing I'm also trying to finish using, this is the Essential uh, Rich Premier Damage Care. Um, I think I have a little bit of the pink one left which I have no idea where I kept it so I will probably finish using and I'll show you guys the finished one, the pen ones. And um, yeah, this is the Venus uh, Gillette one which I really need to change a bit of my razor, it's getting blunt. So of course I have a few packs of the Q10 Beauty Diary mask with me because I tend to keep a little bit here to encourage myself that I need to do my mask like maybe two times a week or something like that, that should be enough and then there's more like sample size stuff that you can get uh, this is like conditioner, treatment conditioner and this is also like from Bio Essence this is the Bird's Nest uh, Whitening Sleeping Mask which I'm going to try later tonight, I'll let you know and then, yeah, that's there. So, that's the other side of my door. I just showered, so this place is kind of like maybe a little bit wet and that's the entrance to my room. So, yeah, I hope you have a fun time knowing what's in my shower. Sorry if it shakes around too much or something. So, I really hope you like it. And leave a video res response to me, uh, what's in your shower. And uh, also comments if you guys know of like good products, like specialty toner that I can try. So, yeah, talk to you guys next time. Bye!